What's up, guys? It's your boy Boss of Video Games, and today we're here with something new, 100% new, never seen before, probably seen before. Um, I'm gonna have episodes of this every Sunday. They're gonna be long. Let me go ahead and tell you that they're gonna be long. But it's gonna, um, I guess week one would be the hardest. Week one would probably be the longest, which it was, because I had to do all of this. But basically, during the draft, I will explain. So right now, I'm making my own coach. And I did a fantasy draft, so just know all the teams are going to be mixed up. <laughs> and let me tell you why I'm doing it like this. Yeah, um, it, you probably read the title. Well, even if you read the title, you still don't know what this is about. But right now, I'm fast forwarding this so y'all won't have to see, you know, y'all won't have to see all of that. Because it's, well, I'm not fast forwarding now, but I will. But basically, the challenge is. The Giants to are draft the team of only running backs, which you see I'm doing now. But um, that draft alone took me about 10 minutes, so we're just gonna fast forward that. And um, while it's fast forwarding, I'll go ahead and tell y'all the gist or whatever. So we're gonna draft a team of all running backs only and. Obviously, they are not all going to stay a running back, but only running backs. So, I'm going to put in a couple running backs, a wide receiver, a couple at, um, you know, safety, strong safety, cornerback, linebacker, defensive end, stuff like that, right? But once I finish this draft, I noticed how retarded I was. Not really, but this is what happened. So, I picked the power backs, right? Because I need power backs from my defensive line and offensive line. And from my offensive line, I noticed. Why the freak didn't I draft any fullbacks? I'm only drafting halfbacks. Fullbacks and halfbacks, they're both running backs. So, it would have counted. And I want to hear it. All right. But anyway, so you can say this is 100% halfbacks only. I was so mad because, yo, in the first game, which I won't spoil it, I was getting killed, man. Killed, 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 killed. All of that, killed, man. It was terrible. But I'm almost done with the draft now, so we about to get into the game. I'll show y'all the lineup at, well, we gotta fast forward again. For me, when I'm editing the players, you know, putting them in different positions, but, yeah. Y'all really thought I was that bad? No. Alright, look. I already did the positions. There's my defense. You see it. That's pretty much what I chose. And um, just to let y'all know, Derek Johnson is going to be my user for a middle linebacker, even though he's a 12 overall. What are y'all thoughts going into this season? I'm going to try and do, like I said, do one of these episodes every Sunday. Get it up by Sunday at least. Try and do them on the weekend. But if it's not uploaded by Sunday, I'm going uh, I'm to have another video for y'all. And, um, yeah, so, that's the team, you see it. The thing is, alright, let me go ahead and tell you three things, alright. The punter, the kicker, and my quarterback, their stats, yeah, you know, I had to edit them a bit. Even though editing the punter and the kicker stats didn't do nothing at all, which you will see when I play this game. The quarterback stats, because I had um, the Broncos running back at quarterback. Because, you can't lie, he kind of looked like Patrick Mahomes. 
just a little bit like the hairstyle maybe but anyway his stats were terrible but it's not like he's overpowered I think the highest he had was a 78 short throw and he's still a um see he's still a 37 but yeah so go ahead and put your predictions I gotta face the Cowboys not the real Cowboys because again it was a fantasy draft but the um fake ones you can say and then skip to the game yeah I'm not skip to the game your season goal comes oh yeah the Make the Super Bowl. If it could have went under four wins, I would have definitely your put it under four your wins, game but... plan. So this means I'm putting everything on the line. Because if I don't make the Super Bowl, I get fired. That's great for me, isn't it? So, first the Cowboys. Who do y'all think is going to win? To be honest, going into this game, I really... I think I'm gonna win. I really think I'm gonna win. I put my lucky jerseys on and everything. I was feeling good from last night. Well, this morning and last night. From when I whooped on Uncle Kevin. Go watch that video. Whooped on Doc. You know, as usual, but. <clears throat> so I kept Kareem Hunt at running back, which. I was planning on keeping Saquon there, but Saquon had like a 70, 73, 77, something like that, catching. So I had to put him at, um, I had to put him at freaking, um, you know what I'm talking about, um, uh, wide receiver. And you can see here, the kicking didn't do anything. Literally, look at that. That is terrible. And that happened all game, which is why my um, initial plan was to play the first game, then the sim to the season to see if we made the playoffs in the Super Bowl. That wasn't going to work out because I knew if he kept kicking like that, we wouldn't win any games. So I just said I'd make a series out of it. So that's what I did. And that's why I'm here. And that should have been a pick. And, you know, as I was, like, playing this game, I noticed how trash my life is. Like, literally, for no reason at all, just for entertainment purposes. And that's going to happen a lot. The tackling, miss tackles, that happens a lot this game. But anyway, for entertainment purposes... Purposes. I <clears throat> made a full team of halfbacks, and I'm gonna try and play a whole season with them without throwing my controller across the room. Wow. How boring does your life have to be? Like literally, literally. Oh, uh, that made me mad. Have y'all ever been so bored y'all just started thinking of random things like like this this right here is a perfect example of how much stupidity and weirdness goes on in my head because literally I, I'm saying literally too much man all right let me stop saying that <clears throat> this morning last night um, Doc was like, yo, download the, um, Ghost Recon Breakpoint because, you know, I love Wildlands. If y'all watch my channel, y'all know I'm a Wildlands person. Breakpoint is the stuff. Played it all morning. I got a couple clips, but I'm gonna play some more to get some more clips, you know. I could have easily kept playing that to get more clips and make a video of the beta. Which, I'm going to get that as soon as possible. It comes out October the 4th. I'm going to get that game as soon as possible. But instead of doing that, I decided that I was going to make a full team of halfbacks. 
And you see here, I guess during the um, preseason when I skipped it, they decided to sign the quarterback. And I'm no cheater, so I ran the ball here. But we don't cheat around here, so what I did, I took him out. And right after this game, I cut him. So, you don't got to worry about them no more. Put um, Limp, Limp C, however you say his name, back in. So, Dallas scored, sadly. Let's see how we're going to do on offense. We're going to do good, do bad, I don't know. Well, I do know, but, you know, I'm not spoiling nothing around here. You're going to have to watch the video. You know what I'm saying? Alright, you will see me editing his stats, editing his stats, doing nothing. And look at that. Which is why I should have drafted fullback. The amount of sacks I had in this game are astronomy. Astronomy. However you say that word. I might even put a sack counter in the corner. Look at look. First throw. First throw of the game. And interception. Which I shouldn't have thrown that, so it's kind of my fault. But it's not my fault. Be honest. I hope there's not negative thoughts in his head going forward since that's his first throw of the game. What can you say? I remember about him coming out of school. He's able to wipe things away pretty easily and move on. Then Derek Henry got hurt. Which I know it's messed up, but I was kind of glad for because we didn't have to worry about him. And I initially thought going into this challenge, the two things I wouldn't have to worry about was getting burned deep and other people's run game because I drafted all the running backs. Huge mistake. Huge mistake. And it's like, y'all see how long it takes for my line to get back there, but let's go Ingram. But it takes them so long and I get their running backs. But come on, man. Cole quit on to kick as he sends it away. All right, so we get the, the ball field back. 7-0. We're down as you do. What an ideal punt. An ideal punt, and it leads to that term complimentary football. Because them doing that... I know y'all gonna get mad at the next couple plays that happen because of how they happen. It puts them in that position. You'll find out why. And no... That made me mad, but Christian no, McCaffrey, McCaffrey is at wide receiver, I promise to you, down. he's at wide receiver, it's just, um, they didn't have Kareem, Kareem, Kareem Hunt on the field, so, yeah. And able to get it across the 20 before they get to him. Yeah, 12 yards there and a first down. But let's see. We got that short throw accuracy. But you better not try and throw deep. And he's brought down, getting this one up to about the 35. It's a pickup of 12. Second play in a row with a 12 yard gain. You ain't doing nothing. You ain't doing nothing. From the shotgun now, here's an inside give. McCaffrey with the run. I really can't play the end. This will probably be the last play of the quarter. Second and six. It sucks for me. Look at the sacks, man. Like, I can't take a snap without getting sacked. Wait. I was going to say I can't take a snap on the center. Which I really can't because I can't call play action at all. And he can only manage to take the football to the 40. And that is well shy of the first. Go forward on fourth down. I barely got it, but I got it. Look at that. That beautiful catch. And Saquon is about to show y'all why I put him at a wide receiver. If 40 could have picked up that block, that could have went somewhere. 
the spark that ignited the Cowboys Giants but rivalry goes back to 1960 good. when Dallas's first head coach and former New York Giants assistant Tom Landry brought his own she can't get the right game going. Oh, oh crap. crap. That game would finish a 31-31 tie, the only non-loss in the expansion Cowboys first season. Six decades later, still on oh, I hate when I do this, man. I keep pulling my mic out, man. Jason Garrett spent 3 it seasons. Sucks. Have y'all ever pulled y'all's mic out? It's the worst thing I've literally. Oh my gosh. He could have caught that. I thought he caught that. No, like, like I know I already played this game, but I thought he just now caught it because I just looked up. I was like, oh, he caught it. No. I should have waited. I could have. Oh, no. Oh, he was wide open. Who was texting me? Try to convert on third and six after the four yard completion. Okay. Sorry about that, y'all. Back to throw. Lindsay. Oh my God. Lipsy. If y'all could have heard my reaction, I think y'all might have heard it. Y'all might hear me in the background. Because my mic was on. PlayStation mic. Look, I faked that because I was like. There's no way. But I got totally bailed out with that pass interference, man. Like 100% got bailed out with that pass interference. But I went for it because... Oh, my God. Silence my phone. Okay. All right. Be back in here. I ran for it. Spoilers. I mean, Lindsey is a running back, so which I didn't take advantage of much this um game that I could scramble. I went for it because you know there's no way I'm gonna make a field goal. Extra point, a field goal and extra point. But I get it, so that's good. The Johnson, but it's like. I need a better O line. So, this is what I'm going to do, Art. My challenge, my rules. So, I'm going to stick to what I said. You know, no, um. No. No, no. Nothing other than running back. See, I don't have these things thought of, man. They're not scripted, written down, or nothing. But. No one other than running back. Okay. So I'm going to keep it at that. But I will add this rule. I can trade for other running backs. And fullbacks count as a running back. I don't care what you think. A fullback is a running back. Just a bigger version of one. <clears throat> so I'm going to try and make a couple of trades, you know. And um, pick up people in free agency. And yeah, but still running back. So. And like, I wanted to get a pick. Six. Look at that. See, they can't, and I still didn't get a tackle. They can't tackle or anything, man. Like, for real. Oh, and. I think I'm only do this one season. Look at that. You push them into the end zone. But this is what we're gonna do, okay? We're gonna do one season with the um running back. So thank God that should last up the 17 weeks. Well, really 16 because I'm obviously gonna skip the bye week. Do next week, that week. But 16 weekends. 16 videos, alright? And after that, maybe we um, decide on another to do like this. Maybe wide receivers or cornerbacks or defensive tackles, which is one I'm dreading. But I'm going to try. It's going to take a while, but I'm going to try and literally do every single position in the Ooh, that was beautiful. Should have been an interception, but 
you can't lie to those people. And you, and you won't believe how this drives him. Watch Saquon. Oh my god, he is a beast. But y'all won't believe how this drive ended. I couldn't believe how this drive ended. It made me so... Well, you're going to have to wait to see. Alright, he dropped that. Just let you know. My recording, it had ran out, so I had to start another screen recording. Because, you know, it can only last like 60 minutes, an hour. And that one was already, um... It was already 60 minutes because it doesn't fast forward. I got to edit the video to make the fast forward, but that fast forwarding went from 10 minutes to 1 minute, thanks to me, and this video would have been about 70 minutes long if I didn't fast forward that, and skip the part where uh, that's a holding, and if I didn't skip the part where I was editing their um, positions, because that took me an additional 20 minutes plus this was tough worth it because I don't have to do it anymore for the next couple weeks one of the things I thought I had putting one of my running backs that um tied in was the speed but I put one of my big running backs that tied in so I don't really have the speed I forced that, which I thought was almost an interception. Should have been. And calling this play was probably the worst mistake of my life. And you will see exactly why. You'll see, why. see, I can't. I throw the screen. He doesn't even catch it, which makes me so mad. But the fact he kicked the ball and ran off three seconds was the worst part. So the why it's one of the most the worst mistakes. But you see why. If they didn't have that kick returner back there, I swear. Just look at this. He would have been gone if that kick returner wasn't back there, man. And judging by the time, if those three seconds didn't get run out because of that dumb play, I could have went down, caught a timeout, and even well, definitely not get the field goal. I had another chance to score a touchdown. But that's not what lost me this game. Ah, oh, freak, man! I lost the game. Okay, it's like. It's like the real the week one at the Giants. I lost, but y'all won't believe how I lost. It is a good game. I mean, it is a terrible game because I lost. But it is alright. In the meantime, comment. And, yeah, tell me. Oh my God! Get the words that are. <clears throat> Restart. Comment below and tell me what um, videos y'all want to see, what games y'all want me to get. Oh, and to answer a question most of y'all probably asked between Call of Duty and Breakpoint, which one am I getting first? It's going to be Breakpoint. Because I didn't play the Call of Duty, that catch was beautiful. I didn't get to play the Call of Duty's open beta. So I can't really judge that one, but I'm gonna get break point and then call of duty. But don't worry, I'm gonna get both of them. Right? So don't you worry. I should have been scrambled on that play. I dropped back too far. I'm not gonna hurry up as usual because I'm so impatient. I threw it to the wrong person, but it worked out. And that pass was inaccurate, but my boy made it happen. Which I like. See, I just can't get the run game going. And it's not the fact that it's not Kareem Hunt's fault. It's the line, man. They get no blocking. That catch was beautiful. And remember, these are running backs. But, like, my line is a Terrible, man. That should have been a pick. Hey, 
It wasn't. So, so I go for it here, which I call that same play again, I think. Or do I throw it? Yeah, I call that. Play. I almost got it, but it'd be that one person back there, man. I'm trying to tell you. It'd be the singular, singular person back there. But really, I should have had. I should have at least 21. Because I should have scored before halftime. And rather I, whether I hit that, um, I get the two-point conversion or not. You get what I'm saying. I should I should have had that touchdown, basically. And we can't tackle or anything. But hey, as long as we push him out of bounds or something. I know, I know what I'm gonna do next. I might do a cornerback because that would be the most By the way, while we're on the subject, I want him to go beat. But while we're on the subject, oh my God, that tackle! Well, not tackle, but like, dang. That, that was terrible. Anyway, while we're on the subject, though, positions. Tell me what position, as in like quarterback, running back, half back. You know what I mean, wide receiver, middle linebacker, all of that. Between all of them, which one do you think has the better chance of winning the Super Bowl? Because that's, that's really what this is about. Seeing which teams come closest, if none of them make the Super Bowl, or which ones win or make it to the Super Bowl. Basically, to see which position is better, my predicament would be wide receiver because wide receivers, wide receivers and cornerbacks because they're they can do everything. Let's just admit it, they can do everything. Man. But yeah, so tell me what y'all think in the comments. Y'all won't believe how this drive in it. 14-14, right? It's kind of like what happened when I lost to my stepdad. That should have been a pick. But imagine that. Yeah, yeah. Exactly pretty much what happened to my stepdad. If y'all haven't seen that video, go watch it while I lost to my stepdad. It's pretty much me breaking down. But I was waiting for that, man. Finally, a user pick. This made me so mad. All right. I was happy off the interception, right? But got to get out the end zone. That lane is open. A normal line, I wouldn't have got a safety. Or maybe I should have just kept running straight up the middle. But my line is so garbage, man. And that, you seen it, right? You seen the kick meter was point on, and look at that. So you can't say it's me, all right? Because it's not. But yeah. Get him for a loss. Let's go. We need to force a punt. Is what I'm saying to myself. Force a punt or get another interception, right? Because that's the only why I'll be back in this game. I need to get the ball back. Let's go. Another tackle for a loss. Let's go. Push him out of field goal range. Right? Alright, it's pretty simple. Don't give up the big play. How hard could it be? Oh, how wrong was I? Why am I so terrible? And I seen him. I seen him. I was literally screaming. He did not get the first down. Which he didn't. But they still managed to kick a field goal. 
sure they are buff off after they make that. Tell you what, he's been able to put the ball in some tight spots all game long. That throw no different. Yeah, a lot of people call it a gutsy type of throw. Corner, but yeah. So it's not that big of a deal to me. I'm going to keep fighting. Alright, so five point game. So they I'm get about five. Get the ball back. Let's go down here and score, right? Look at the smiles on that side of the field. It's a little tight, aren't they? And they had scored a touchdown there. Those would be big half-moon wins right now because they feel a whole lot better about the position. Why do I see the position? The safety. Oh, my God, man. The safety. Lost me this game. And my O line. Safety in my O line. Last play got just a yard. Here's second and now for the 26. Barely have enough time to throw the ball. But that catch is beautiful. And after I throw. What? After he caught that, I was like, yes, I'm still in it. You got this. You got this. Nope. Line is terrible. Still. Yeah, I'm, I need to get some half that. That throw was stupid, stupid, because I could have thrown the interception. Which I don't remember, but I think I did. But hey, we're going to both find out. Yep, I knew it. And they'll start that out with great field position yeah. at the 47-yard line in enemy territory. See, I was in it till I do that stupid play. Why didn't I run the ball? I don't know why. Why didn't I just sit there and take the sack and scramble? Why didn't I pick that off? I asked myself these questions. That should have been an interception. Why'd he slide? Why didn't he... Pull a Malcolm Butler and bump him out the way and pick it. Like, come on. Fourth quarter, down to the final two minutes, and we've got a one score game. I'm getting so mad. Just watching this. Let's see what they've come up with offensively. Get a sack there. Okay. Get a sack there, call a timeout. Uh, and one more sack, he would be out of three. Right so he would be a long field goal. But I highly doubt it. Because of that, even though I call man, he still nearly gets the first down. That play puts him back in the game, 31. My dumb self calls his own, thinking he's going to run. Why wouldn't he run? Oh, he's just like me. Play action. How come they pull back? Y'all see how the line pulls back? Why? Why didn't they just go inside the quarterback? When I call those plays, my quarterback is set. They call those plays their quarterback is set. That's just common for what I did, but I'm not. But, kept hopes alive. Even though I knew 100%, there's no way I was going to win this game. But I was like, alright, maybe if I score a touchdown, since they're running backs, they might be able to hurry up and pick up the um, onside kick. So let's see how this drive goes. This is really just for you know what I'm saying, just, 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 for the just for pride, yeah, that's the word, just for pride, which it really served no purpose, I only took my pride down, <clears throat> looking bad, that could have been an interception, he was open at one point, but it's just, Dempsey, man. The Giants on third he freaking down. sucks, man. I mean, he's a good running back and all. That should have been a pick. But it should have been a touchdown after it should have been a pick. So, Lipsy. Lipsy, however you say his name. He's alright. But that. Right, that play. Scary, scary. <laughs> I seen I had a minute and four seconds left. What do I call slot post angle, y'all? And watch what happens here. 
Throwing again. Lindsay. What's that? And a fumble. So you're telling me you're a running back, but you get sacked, which is really just a tackle. And you fumble. And then I call my timeout. And they do a booth review to see if it's a real fumble. And they give me two seconds back. I call a screenplay, but my line is so trash. I can't even throw the screen without getting sacked. Like, how can she throw a screen for it? It's literally one, two, throw the ball. That's all it is. Fourth and 33, definitely not good. Man. Doesn't even throw it to my guy. Like, throws it at the ground. Basically, they just need the ball. And that's, that's how I lost. The All right. I promise you, the next game, Cowboys looking good here next weekend, obviously, really won't be 37 minutes long. It's going to be like 16. I'm going to edit it more, you know, take the unnecessary clips out. Maybe throw my regular edits in like I usually do because this one, I just talked over it, which I know you guys don't want to hear me just talk over it. See, actually, in edits, I actually do. But we lost that game, so we're 0-1, but we're going to make a comeback. The only reason I did it like this tonight is because everything else I had to do. Like, if you had to spend about an hour just preparing the video before you even edit it, you would slack on editing too. So, yeah, but until next time, guys, peace out. Don't forget, to, well... Uh, it tell you at the end of the video, so tune in next week. Now let's take a minute Peace. to see how you can improve your team. Start your week by installing your game.